Faster in the old age. I don't. I don't. I'm suffering in my old age. I um. Yeah, that one hurt a lot. That hurt a lot. I had to. Yeah. I only. I had to. In the end, I had to let it let him come and then um, try and get as close to the line as I could before I just went all in. And uh, yeah, I really paid for it when I crossed the line there at the end. I was completely spent. But that's how you want to be, isn't it? So. Um, but do you think? Did you on the outs and bike? Did you think he was? Did you think there was a chance he was going to catch or? Absolutely, yeah. In fact, I was almost certain he was going to catch at one point. I was like, right, I'm going to not try and kill myself here. I'm going to just be calm and if he catches me, I'll try and go with him. But then he stopped catching me as, as, as quickly and uh, yeah, I was able to hold the gap. And then um, once we got to a couple of K to go and it's about a minute, then yeah, I was home and hose. Did, did you wonder where he was on the bike? No, nah, I knew it was a long way back. <laughs> Mate, hey, I was looking you, at the splits. I thought you were, it was so... It was yeah. You were gaining. Yeah. Oh well, right? At the end of the day, you don't make it, you don't make it, right? It was fun though, it was good. It hurt. I need to break from Iron Master a little while. They hurt. Yeah, it was, it was, it was a, everything went perfect. It was a really good day perfect conditions and uh, obviously it was a tight competition so it pushes the pace and uh, big big grip on the bike was moving and didn't blow up on the run so yeah I, I thought that when I'm the newbie that I don't have to, <laughs> <laughs> to take my turn there at the front uh, I can just <laughs> figure out what the situation is there and then on the run I Leonel went out pretty hard and I knew that I, I could not run that pace and then I just ran my own pace 350 there tried to hold that and uh, it was that until pretty much the and so it was good. The race was good. Um, did my personal best, so finally went under eight hour. So that's good. Thanks. <laughs> so I think I came at six or yeah. So, last week I remember Frankfurt eleven. Now six. Maybe next week even better. It was pretty hard. First 21k on the run was really good. Like uh, two minutes off the cam only. And then the hammer came, so I'm happy with the race under sub eight. So first time for that, so nothing to complain about. And I did it uh, solo all the way, so yeah, I had like 5k with uh, Cameron, and uh, that was it. <laughs> it was uh, it was really good uh, conditions today, so no, I'm I'm happy with it. It was uh, my first Ironman I finished in like two years now, so yeah. You need to get it done so you know the feeling, so you can push all the way next time and pace yourself better. So. Yeah, the bike was really, really good, better than expected actually. I, I was riding with uh, Lionel and uh, uh, Plese, uh, two strong riders, and uh, yeah, that really panned out as I, as I hoped. So uh, good, fast course and good, fast conditions and uh, good legs. The run was a bit of a struggle, but it was all right. I think I did 8.07 or something. It's very nice. I did my first Ironman here in 2015. So yeah, it's just nice to come back, improve, improve your time. Uh, you know the course, it's uh, kind of a uh, 
home soil race, uh, even though I don't live in Copenhagen. So yeah, I really like it.